Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I'd like to show you how you can add your own skybox into Unity 5. So you can see here I've already got one, and we're going to be adding one similar to this with the Cope Free Skybox Pack, which is an asset you can download for free from the Asset Store. So if we go to the Asset Store and we type in Skybox, hit Enter, uh, filter by free if you wish, you can find a whole bunch of different skyboxes. The one I'm using is the third one on the list, the Cope Free Skybox Pack. So if you click that, you download it, and you add it to, well, you import it into your assets directory. Then you'll have it there to work with. So inside of this uh, directory, there's going to be uh, basically two folders, uh, the materials and the TIFF images. So each of these skyboxes are composed of six different images, and that's what makes up the full material. You can see when we click on the materials, in the top right, it's got the skybox uh, six-sided shader, and each of those six images are selected for the different sides of the skybox. Now, to add this as our actual skybox inside of Unity, we need to go to Window, Lighting, and one of the first options you see is going to be skybox. What it's looking for here is a material, like you can see here I've added the forest material. So let's go ahead and try changing that to Mossy Mountain. So just drag that over, let go and you have a skybox inside of your game. So um, to prove that, let's go ahead and run the game real quickly. And you can see that as uh, the character moves, you can see that the plane comes into view in respect to that, but the skybox stays the same. The skybox is the background. And uh, that's really all there is to adding a skybox in Unity 5. So I've been Chris. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and I'll see you in my future content.